again to another Wednesday night. I'm glad that everyone's here today, uh, despite the hot, humid weather that we're having. Uh, thankfully, I work in a cooler most of the day, so. <laughs> but I know how hot it can be during those nights. Uh, I just uh, thank the Lord for the different uh, seasons that He's given us, and I, you know, I'll, most people are like, I can't wait for summer or just come and get outside. And I can't wait for winter. <laughs> So, praise the Lord. But like I said, I'm, I'm just glad to be here again today, and I'm glad to know my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And He's, uh, he's alive, and He's here, and He's with us today. And I just thank the God for just having the Word being brought forth and spoken. And it can be anywhere, anytime, any place. The Lord's will cannot be stopped. It cannot be moved. And so, I'd like to go ahead before we begin singing here, just to open this up uh, with a prayer. So, Father in heaven, O oh Lord Jesus, I again thank you once again, O oh Lord God, for another glorious day that you've given to us, O oh Lord God. And I just thank you, O oh Lord Jesus, wherever and however, O oh Lord God, thy will has been brought forth, O oh Lord God. I just am so honored, O oh Lord God, that you've given this privilege to man to do thy will, O oh Lord God, for thy glory and for thy honor, O oh Lord Jesus. I again thank you, O oh Lord God, for giving us this word, O oh Lord God. I thank you, O oh Lord God, through the works that you've done through Jesus Christ, O oh Lord Jesus. I just ask, O oh Lord God, I know that this world is getting darker and more wicked every day, O oh Lord Jesus, and I'm just amazed by your patience and glory, O oh Lord God, that there are still some people out there, O oh Lord God, that you're calling to repentance. I just ask, O oh Lord God, tonight, O oh Lord, as we're once again gathering to hear thy word, O oh Lord Jesus, let thy hedge of protection, let thy blood be upon us, O oh Lord God. Remove the devil, O oh Lord God, and remove any hex vexes and curses that might come against us, O oh Lord God, but not only against us, O oh Lord Jesus, but our brothers and sisters, O oh Lord God, wherever they may be, O oh Lord God, gathering where two or more are gathered, O oh Lord, it says that thou shalt be in the midst of them, O oh Lord Jesus. And I just thank you, O oh Lord God, for all the things that you do. In thy precious name we ask. Amen. If you can turn with me to uh, page 283 in your uh, book. Sweet by and by, you know, I just, uh, the song came to me earlier today, and, you know, it's just an awesome song, and it's just, I, like I said, you know, I'm just so tired, and just, just waiting for that day where we will meet Jesus on that beautiful shore, where he said that I go to prepare a place for you, and if I go to prepare a place for you, I will come again. You know, a lot of people think that God's abandoned us, Jesus Christ abandoned us, but if they read their Bibles and read that verse... That should make anyone happy. He goes to prepare a mansion, a place for you. So i like to sing 283, The Sweet By and By.
he's gone to prepare a place for us. And it's just, by grace are ye saved, through faith, not that of your works. It is a gift of God, lest any man should boast. And I'm just so great, grateful for that grace. Grace meaning undeserved love. And it's just unfathomable to believe that instead of taking Jesus down from that cross and letting his only son that was born sinless led a sinless life to die for us. To die for us so that we might have life through Jesus Christ. I just, <laughs> we live, we serve an awesome Lord. So I like to uh, continue on with the whole fact of uh, just the coming of our Lord here with uh, 173 when we all get to heaven. And, you know, we have, uh, we have many of our brothers and sisters throughout the years go on and uh, meet our Lord and Savior. And, of course, our dear pastor uh, a couple of months ago went to receive his reward. But you know what? That's not, that's not it for us. I mean, just because Pastor Meyer went on doesn't mean that we'll never see him again. So I'm just so gr glad that the Bible says God is not the God of the dead, but of the living. And if we believe in Jesus Christ, we shall see not only him, which I quite frankly want to just to see him, <laughs> but we can see all our loved ones that love Jesus Christ. So I like to sing 173, When We All Get to Heaven.
be able, you know, they don't know if being a Christian is going to be victorious, but I like how Pastor put it, well, read the back the last couple of chapters, we won. So we have victory through Jesus Christ because the devil was stripped of his power at Calvary. And so Jesus has the keys of hell and of death, and Jesus is the only way of salvation, the only way of life, true life. So that's why I'd like to sing uh, tonight uh, one more song here, My Jesus, I Love Thee, because, you know, I just can't get enough of our Lord and Savior, and I just would love just to shout and sing to the Lord for as long as I can. But, <laughs> uh, but for time's sake, we'll just sing this here, My Jesus, I Love Thee, 328. 328. Oh. 